Hey guys, um, this is going to be a review of the Odyssey Quadrant Rims in, yeah, I don't know if you guys can see that quadrant, um, in safety or in image. Um, it's going to be a pretty quick review considering my phone's kind of low on battery. Quadrant. So yeah, um, they're really good rims. The spokes um, tend to kind of loosen up, but after they loosen up a little bit, um, they don't go any like farther. Like they're still fine. I think they just stretched. It's a pretty good rim. Even if you use clear pads, you will still get these marks. I don't know. Can anybody leave me an answer to that in the comments? I'm using Odyssey Slim by Four pads. Those are clear and still leaving me marks on both sides. Pretty thick marks like that, like all the way around. And that's how you can tell if your wheel is true. If, if um, the line on the brake skid marks, yeah, is consistent, like the same thickness all the way around, that means your wheel's true because there's not a point where it's gripping better than the other points. So, if you look all the way around, it's pretty, it's pretty much consistent. And, yeah. Um, if you're getting it colored, beware of brakes. It will, your rim will look like this, but if it's a black rim, you won't have to worry. Um, front's perfect, because I don't have brakes in the front like a normal person would not have brakes in the front, but yeah, so pretty well, that's laced up to a Vandero 2, and that's an Odyssey V3, and using Odyssey spokes, and it's holding up pretty well, I mean, I can show you guys how true it is, um, this is the back rim, so... It's like true, pretty true, and I've had it for a while now. And that's my review on Odyssey Quadrant Rim. Um, good rim, pinned, four pinned though, so it's like twice as much as a regular rim. And that's the where it gets connected. Cause, yeah. And that's my review. All right, leave questions and comments in below. And please subscribe.